Okay, so this video is on converting from degrees to radians. And here I drew two coordinates, or two axes. Here we have, uh, for degrees, so this would be the x-axis. This is the y-axis. So here, when you start off on with, with degrees, well, you start off with zero degrees. And as you go around, you, you go to 90, 180, 270. And if you go from here all the way around back to this, and you would travel 360 degrees. Well, uh, here in the radian system, it's pretty much exactly the same thing. It's just in radians. Uh, so you start with here with zero radians, and you go to pi over 2 radians, pi radians, uh, 3 over 2 pi radians, and all the way back over here would be 2 pi radians, which would be a complete circle. So now, in order to convert these, uh, all you have to do is this. Let's go down here so I can just show you that. So let's say we have, mm, let's say we have 20 degrees. We want to convert that into radians. So first thing you do is you say, well, I'm going to multiply these 20 degrees by pi over 180 degrees. So pi radians divided by 180 degrees. So first thing we say is, well, okay, let's uh, reduce these down. 20 goes into 20 once. 20 goes into 180 nine times. So then you just multiply the one by pi. So you would get pi over nine radians. That is equal to 20 degrees. So that's how you would convert in going from degrees into radians. So now let's try a different one. Um, how about 10 degrees? If you're going, if you want to convert 10 degrees into radians, again you just multiply it by pi over 180 degrees. Pi radians divided by 180 degrees. So 10 goes into 10 once. 10 goes into 180 uh, 18 times. So that's going to be equal to pi over 18 radians. And that's equal to 10 degrees. So that's how we convert that. Now, if we want to go the opposite direction, you just do the exact same thing, but uh, in reverse. So let's see. Let's say we have, um, I don't know. Uh, oh, oh, you're not writing. Come on now. Uh, let's say 3 over 2 pi. So we're going to multiply this by... Now, when since we're going from radians into degrees, now you're going to flip it. Now you're going to put the 180 on top, and you're going to put the radians on the bottom. You do this so these cancel out. So the radians here cancel out with the radians on top. So let's go ahead and do this. <clears throat> so 2 goes into 2 once. 2 goes into 180 90 times. Now... Uh, so let's let's take it a, a step further. So this is going to be three pi times ninety all over pi. So now these two pi's cancel out, and you're just left with three times ninety, which is equal to two hundred and seventy degrees, which makes sense because that's what we had right here. See, I said three pi over two, which is exactly the same thing as two hundred and seventy degrees. Because if you come all, if you start here and you go all to here, that's uh, 3 pi over 2 radians. Same thing over here, if you go starting from 0 and go all the way this way, that would be 270 degrees. So that is how you convert from um, that's how you convert from uh, radians uh, radians into degrees. So 3 pi over 2 this is exactly the same thing as 270 degrees. So that's how you do it. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I hope it helped you out. So good luck in your classes.